As you may have noticed, Nauvoo's history attracts many visitors and keeps residents like me on their toes. We've already taken a deep look into Nauvoo's rich history, but today, to gather a better understanding, we're going to take an inside look at the Joseph Smith Historic Site. Do you know where the Nauvoo Flats are? They're sitting on them, exactly. Each family buys an acre, builds a house, plants a garden, chickens, milk cows, fruit trees. You live here, you farm on the prairie above. It's a beautiful plan soon overwhelmed by their missionary success. Thousands of new members, many from the British Isles, were moving in. And imagine all the sights and sounds of perhaps 12,000 people, 10 times our current population, and then second in size only to Chicago and Illinois. 12,000 people here as they went about trying to literally build God's kingdom on earth, starting right here in Nauvoo. Okay, Nauvoo House, you see what's left. This was gonna be a massive hotel. They hoped to put in the 1840s 300 Nauvoo visitors in this building. And it was gonna be Joseph and Emma Smith's home. Emma would later tell her children, who would tell their children, that the graves were not far off the corner of the homestead underneath a little outbuilding. But after many decades, all the outbuildings were long gone. So the family knew that the graves were here, but they didn't know that they were exactly there. 